Little Cloud by Eric Carl. The clouds drifted slowly across the sky. Little cloud trailed behind. The clouds pushed upward and away. Little cloud pushed downward and touched the tops of the houses and trees. The clouds moved out of sight. Little cloud changed into a giant cloud. Little cloud changed into a sheep. Sheep and clouds sometimes look alike. Little cloud changed into an airplane. Little cloud often saw airplanes flying through the clouds. Little cloud changed into a shark. Little cloud once saw a shark through the waves of the ocean. Little cloud changed into two trees. Little cloud liked the way trees never moved and stayed in one place. Little cloud changed into a rabbit. Little cloud loved to watch rabbits dash across the meadows. Little cloud changed into a hat because little clown changed into a clown and needed a hat. The other clouds drifted back. They huddled close together. Little cloud, little cloud, they called, come back. Little cloud drifted toward the clouds. Little cloud changed into one big cloud and rained. Next, the artist who painted a blue horse. I am an artist and I paint a blue horse and a red crocodile and a yellow cow and a pink rabbit and a green lion and an orange elephant and a purple fox and a black polar bear and a polka dotted donkey. I am a good artist. Next. The Mixed Up Chameleon by Eric Carl. On a shiny green leaf sat a small green chameleon. It moved onto a brown tree and turned brownish. Then it rested on a red flower and turned reddish. When the chameleon moved slowly across the yellow sand, it turned yellowish. You could hardly see it. When the chameleon was warm and had something to eat, it turned sparkling green. But when it was cold and hungry, it turned gray and dull. When the chameleon was hungry, it sat still and waited. Only its eyes moved up, down, sideways until it spotted a fly. Then, the chameleon's long and sticky tongue shot out and caught the fly. That was its life. It was not very exciting, but one day, the chameleon saw a zoo. It had never seen so many beautiful animals. The chameleon thought, how small I am, how slow, how weak. I wish I could be big and white like a polar bear. And the chameleon's wish came true. But was it happy? No. I wish I could be handsome like a flamingo. I wish I could swim like a fish. I wish I could run like a deer. I wish I could hide in a shell like a turtle. I wish I could be strong like an elephant. 
I wish I could be funny like a seal. I wish I could be like people. Just then, a fly flew by. The chameleon was very hungry, but the chameleon was very mixed up. It was a little of this and it was a little of that, and it couldn't catch the fly. I wish I could be myself. The chameleon's wish came true, and it caught the fly. Next, the greedy python. Half hidden in the jungle green, the biggest snake there's ever been, wound back, forth, and in between. The giant snake was very strong and very, very, very long. He had a monstrous appetite, his stomach stretched from left to right. He quickly gobbled in one bite whatever creatures came in sight. A mouse that scampered to and fro, a frog that jumped up from below, a bat that hung from his left toe, a fish that swam a bit too slow, a bird that flew a bit too low, a porcupine still half asleep, a monkey who was in mid leap, a leopard sitting in a tree, a buffalo who came to see. An elephant complete with trunk was swallowed in a single chunk. I'm far too big to eat, he cried. Oh no, you're not, the snake replied. At last the python's meal was done and he lay resting in the sun. The animals inside his skin were making quite a dreadful din. And when they all began to kick, the snake began to feel quite sick. He coughed the whole lot up again, each one of them, and there were ten. He soon felt better, and what's more was hungrier than just before. He hadn't learned a single thing. His greed was quite astonishing. He saw his own tail, long and curved, and thought that lunch was being served. He closed his jaws on his own rear, then swallowed hard and disappeared. The Nonsense Show, written by Eric Carl. Let's get started. Follow this cursor and read each word. Welcome, friends. Don't be slow. Step right up. To the nonsense show. I'm too wet, said the bird. I can't fly, it's absurd. I'm too dry, how I wish. I could swim, said the fish. Ouch, who's that in my pouch? I'm seeking my tail. Can you see where it's gone? hissed snake number one. What a coincidence! Mine's missing too, hissed snake number two. I am supposed to catch you, meowed the cat. Yes, squeaked the mouse. Of course, that's true, but you must know we're in a nonsense show. Oh dear, look here, it says no gas, alas, no gas. Don't worry, we're not in a hurry. What a funny looking ball, thought the tennis ace, <laughs> and wound up with applesauce in her face. One sheep, two sheep, three sheep, four, and after that, how many more? Zzzz. Get out of my house, said the dog. But where can I go? barked the man. For all that I care, you can fly to the moon, but go soon. And that's why we've now got a man in the moon, believe it or not. Upsy, downsy, nice and straight, smile, a mile, bravo, that's great. Who's that I see? It can't be me, 
I'll tell you who it looks like you. Let's trade hats, the rider said. But nay, nay, said the horse. Let's trade hats instead, okay? And so they did, of course. Hurry up, said Bottom. Wait for me, said Top. But they couldn't agree, so they never did stop. Could a leopard change his spot to a tigerish stripe? Probably not. Would a tiger wish to swap his stripe for a leopard's spot? Certainly not. Why is Mr. Up Up? Why is Mr. Down Down? It's not a mistake, it's just how they eat cake. This yellow rubber duck I found has feet for walking on the ground. But don't you think that this duck otter get webbed feet to swim in water? From Head to Toe by Eric Carl. Follow this courser and try to read and practice. I am a penguin and I turned my head. Can you do it? I can do it. I am a giraffe and I bend my neck. Can you do it? I can do it. I am a buffalo and I raise my shoulders. Can you do it? I can do it. I am a monkey and I wave my arms. Can you do it? I can do it. I am a seal and I clap my hands. Can you do it? I can do it. I am a gorilla and I thump my chest. Can you do it? I can do it. I am a cat and I arch my back. Can you do it? I can do it. I am a crocodile and I wriggle my hips. Can you do it? I can do it. I am a camel and I bend my knees. Can you do it? I can do it. I am a donkey and I kick my legs. Can you do it? I can do it. I am an elephant and I stomp my foot. Can you do it? I can do it. I am I and I wiggle my toe. Can you do it? I can do it. I can do it.